Hundreds participated in a virtual town hall on Tuesday evening for a Q&A on the Illinois Criminal Justice Reform Bill with local lawmakers. The bill, also known as HB 3653, passed the Illinois General Assembly this month. Governor Pritzker has yet to sign the bill. Nearly 100,000 Illinois residents have signed a petition asking for the governor to veto the legislation. Lawmakers addressed a list of, quote, major concerns with the legislation before taking public questions. Lawmakers say if the bill is signed, it will lead to reduced public safety and, quote, the decline of the ability for police to do their jobs. If signed, the bill would eliminate cash bail, mandate body cameras be worn at almost all times, and discourage lethal uses of force. The bill also limits protections for police officers involved in criminal cases as a result of their on-duty actions and allows for an unlimited number of anonymous allegations to be filed against an officer. However, State Senator Terry Bryant says one of the biggest concerns of the bill is the overall future of law enforcement. But for those who are young in this, uh, you know, in this field and really love law enforcement, want to stay in it, there are a, a lot of uh, individuals who are talking about just leaving the state, going to serve in another state where they are respected and where they can actually do their jobs. HB 3653 is now on the governor's desk for approval. Governor Pritzker had previously said he wants more time to review the entire bill and is listening to recommendations from law enforcement officials across the state.